Hey everyone, welcome to the next in the series of interviews from the Mingo. This joining me is Ronnie Siegel from the great free state of New <laughs> Jersey. Uh, Ronnie, uh, is this your first mingle? This is my first mingle, yes. Okay, so uh, you fr- being from New Jersey, I, one of the things I like to ask the ladies as they're here is what their everyday carry is. Being from New Jersey, you don't get to carry every day. What is your favorite firearm to shoot? My favorite firearm, my competition, I'm a competitor, mm-hmm. is the Walther PPQ uh, Match Pro Steel. That's my favorite. Mm-hmm. I just won the Tri-State Autism uh, Top Lady competition last weekend with it. Mm-hmm. And the Aruba Open last week. As in Aruba in the Caribbean. Wow. I came in Top Lady last year and this year with my PPC. That's awesome. Yes. That's awesome. So how long have you been into shooting? I've been shooting my entire life, but competing for five years. Okay. What what caused you to get into competition? Well, I joined a girl in a gun because it had everything that I wanted, except a chapter in New Jersey. Mm-hmm. And now we have a chapter in Jersey because I founded it. Very and cool. we are one of the largest chapters in the country, believe it or not, mm-hmm. being in New Jersey. I have close to 100 women, and we I see them about three times a week, and we go. As a matter of fact, this summer, I've rented out an entire range again. It's called the Pocono Blast 2, and it is a training weekend. And I'm teaching them USPSA, IDPA, Steel Challenge, and Steel Knockdown in the weekend and now it's opened up to Pennsylvania. I have a girl flying out from California. So New Jersey may not be a shooting state, but I have women coming in from every end of New Jersey the third Wednesday night a month. You know, with the energy you're showing me, oh, you yeah. could change that. Oh yeah. <laughs> not only that, I had a sheriff come in last year and he did the Utah class and the girls now have thirty eight permits for all over the country and including Virginia and Florida. So now in my basement, I'm teaching Carrie. That's awesome. <laughs> that is absolutely awesome. I have to ask you, the uh, middle of day one, what's your impression of the mingle so far? I think this is something that is so needed in the female gun community. A place where there's sisterhood and we are all on the same page and we learn from one another. It's so well organized and these are the kind of events I like to do as well because they're, they're, they're really needed. And I just want to say I was a high school vice principal for 38 years mm-hmm. and that's probably the reason I got into shooting to begin with. <laughs> And what I do now, it's it's always, once a teacher, always a teacher. Sure. <laughs> right. All right. Well, I'm starting to hear thunder. We need to break this down, and everybody looks like they're heading out. So thank you for taking your thank time you. to talk to us. Thank you so much.